Hey, what's up everybody? My name is TrophyNet and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. Today we're gonna continue the uh, Sunstone Rock quest. Let's see if we can't finish that. So three prisoners escaped and the first one is at Blackwing Snag, this bandit camp we took over a few uh, episodes ago. So if he was... I already got rid of the bandits. I don't think it'll be hard to find this way. Yeah, if he was part of the bandits, I think I already kind of murdered his ass. Because uh, Find Ulia has been stricken true. So I wonder... Where is he? I think I might have already killed him. Okay. And then over there? Was he one of the bandits on the... On I told post? you they would come! Drive her into the dirt! Yeah, she does have a few new moves. What is she holding? Is that a spear or what? Well, it doesn't really matter. Hello, let's talk to her. I do think it's funny that you can talk to these guys you killed. About this, huh? Kind of Assassin's Creed-like. did was talk. Talk, bleed. Talk and shackle me. Do you? You fought like a Tanakh. I'd have taken you for my child. You can't just take a child. The strong take from the weak. And in the taking, I made stronger. These stories pricked into my skin. Look. Children, riches, lives, and land. All of these have been mine. Drink of my... <coughs> my blood. And they'll live on. Okay, then. <gasps> No, Ulia. I've got enough stories to carry. Okay then. So we haven't found a lot of Tanakh. We haven't met a lot of Tanakh. But uh, yeah, there's also a sort of tribe here. I never actually looted this place, but it might be full. Though apparently not. I might have made some space previously. Uh, so yeah, that's the first of the prisoners. And uh, I think the only Tanakh we ever met was one of the women we, we can never helped out done. with the shrines. I think the last one we did near the the pond was uh, a Tanakh as well. But let's head towards our next prisoner, namely Gavan. So we're back at Bright Market where we uh, helped out the... Um, how should I call this? If this Gavan came through here... The inn seems like a good place to start asking. So we helped out the father that has, uh, well, that owns that mansion over there, that giant building over there. And uh, the, the kind of Romeo and Juliet story. I kind of forgot their names. Sorry for that. But somebody's supposed to be here. Are you Gavon? As the sun is my witness, never had a Nora in my house. He looks happy. What about a man named Gavon? Mm, no. Can't say I've heard that name. But uh, we're a trading town. Get a lot of people through. All kinds, I'm sure. Like ones who don't want to be followed. I never heard of your Gavan. If he's trouble, well, can't say I'm sorry. Uh, now, I've things to be doing, Nora girl, if you don't mind. You do have things to be doing? He wasn't suspicious at all. <sighs> Time to take a look around. He's really hiding something. Um, search the in for information about Gavan. There's a lot of animals outside. Um, is it this that I need to check up on? The Nora. Exaggerated sketches of ferocious Nora women. Yeah, okay, never mind. Where is... No. Something I, I can use. Maybe there's something upstairs. Might be, might be. Hello? It seems pretty empty. Nope. Or, oh, wait a second. There are beds here. But nothing of interest. Aha! Manacles! That is interesting. So he got out of his manacles. He wouldn't have gotten this off without help. Okay. You didn't make for the harbor, and you didn't go alone. A track. 
Where is the track leading me? Ah, there we go. The other direction. Does that kind of feel like the harbor is over there? Since that's where all the... The merchants are. Right next to the harbor, but... Where is this track leading? So probably the innkeeper helped him out of his manacles for some reason. And then he just left. Sounds plausible. Kinda not want to antagonize these chargers. No, no. I don't want to have any trouble. Ignore me, please. So up the mountain. Probably went into hiding somewhere. So did Gavon find his friends or his enemies? I suppose they're all the same to me. Did he find his friends or his enemies? Oh, there's a few houses here as well. They weren't happy to see him back. Don't you pass out, Gavon. Get her! Oh. Hey! Ah. Friend of yours, Gavon! Sure. There we go. Are you gonna fire at me or what? There we go. Hello! There we go. Kill the smugglers. I know I need to kill this guy, but he might already be dead. Hello, Gavon. They sent you to take me back to Sunstone? Um, to take you back. Huh. Well. Hashiv's done your job for you. Well, you're not dead yet. Geneva said you were a smuggler, only for the shards. Is that true? <laughs> I could tell you anything. A sick mother, or I did it for the poor children. But he'd be lying. In the year I spent in the cage, all I regretted was killing that guard. Because it got me caught. You can take that back to Sunstone Rock. Okay then. Goodbye, Gavon. Um, you know what? Just to be sure. Um, because, well, he might have been faking. Yeah, now he's not, he's definitely not faking anymore. He kind of got an ER exam there. Um, anything else I need to check? Can't take their desert glass. They're holding quite a bit. So, and with that done, let's head to our last culprit, Razgrunt, or last SKP. So, uh, give me a second. So, Razgrunt, he's apparently hiding in the rainforest here. Why is... Yeah, the marker was pointing me in the wrong direction there. I think I already hear him. Or I hear someone. Okay. Wait, he's the trap maker, right? So I'm gonna have to be careful. Ooh. That is a Deathbringer. Completely destroyed Deathbringer, but yeah, still one... Okay, need to be really careful, because... Yeah, there we go. There's the traps. Let's set them off before we reach them. Might alert him to our oh presence. I thought they'd send soldiers. The mighty Karja Empire must be more strapped than I thought. How sad. No matter... Bounty hunters die like the rest. Welcome to my ravine of death. Are you serious? Sadist, murderer, trap maker, all these things. That's why they put me in that stinking hole. They did? Because, um... You, where, while you were monologuing, I disabled all your traps that I got up here, so... Um, goodbye. I'm sorry to spoil your fun. I don't suppose those behemoths I called to the prison killed Geneva. You're gonna be disappointed. Yeah, that's why I have my toys to distract me from the pain. Oh, so there's one over there. So, why didn't he die? I don't think it was meant to, uh, I was meant to kill him Careful over there. now. Don't slip. I don't know what his plan is, but this is kind of a crappy way to kill me. 
because I can see them from a mile away and they don't really trigger really quickly. So I need to go up there, but I won't be able to reach that. Um, okay. Where's the next one? Can I go over here? Seems like a safer place. Well, not yet, oh yeah. little acrobat. <laughs> Boom! Whoopsie! There we go. Um, over there. Over here. They're giving me a bit of space, so this is probably where he was. Don't really see him anymore. And I do want to be careful with the traps. I hate when she does that. She had the running start to get up there, but apparently she didn't want to. Is there something down here? No. So this is definitely the more interesting one of the three. Oh, there goes the next one. Oh shit. Uh, but you're not on fire yet. Nope. Let's take care of the other one. Yeah, there he goes. Bombs in the water! There's bombs in the water. I'm gonna have to swim a bit faster. There's one on the left. Persistent, aren't you? Yeah, of course we are. Why would we stop while we can easily dispatch your your bombs while we're uh, just walking around? There's one. Yeah, there's one over there. Kind of reminds me of Resident Evil when you're trying to uh, spot the traps. It is a nice change of pace. Can I see him from over here? Doesn't look like it. So let's head on the tree. Just in case. Just in case. Easy does it. Mind your fingers. <laughs> okay, so this is clearly not the way to go. Um, could get over there. Okay. So let's head up here, and I think I can... Yeah, that's the one I saw from back there. There we go. Going up. Avoiding all the bombs. How do I get up there? There's a ledge over there with a bomb. So that's probably where I need to go. I can actually just fire from here, you know. So, triple arrow to the face. Okay, never mind. He's just a statue at this point. Um, there's one. There we go. Jump. And then we're right next to him. Is he gonna use you something? You got me. No more traps. Yeah, he's. Tell Geneva yeah. I'll be a good boy from now on. You expect me to believe that? What's in your hand? <laughs> oh, this? Well, just a little. Oops. Is he gonna blow himself up? Okay then. I guess he died doing what he loved. Blowing shit up. That was interesting. But clearly, yeah, the most interesting guy of the bunch. Because he actually gave me a challenge. Uh, as to the other guys who didn't. Um, so yeah, let's get back to Sunstone Rock and tell Geneva the good news, I think. So back at Sunstone Rock. Yeah, I don't really feel like I did all that good of a thing here, murdering all those criminals. Well, they are criminals, but it doesn't mean you get the right to just murder them on sight. But yeah, kind of a, a, a touchy subject. Um, can I go to the front door already, or do I need to take that hole in the wall to the side again? Doesn't seem like it's fixed yet. It's kind of weird that they don't just open the front door for me. What? But hey, hello Geneva. We uh, took care of your little SKP problem. Your aid to the Karja Sundom in these times of strife is appreciated. That's the official response. I'd say... I can tell you've done the work by the look on your face. Two of them got themselves killed. The other... Welcome to fight to the end. 
They would have found death with or without you, taken others with them. That's what I told myself. Smart girl. Doubt will meet again, so go in light. Okay. Thank this you, I suppose. That was a, a short ending to uh, a bit of a longer side quest. Um, so that's the last of the ally quest. Would I to start the uh, final mission again, I would get one of the final trophies I'm still missing. That uh, every ally would join you in the final fight. I'm not going to do that, of course. But I am going to check out if I have any more side quests to do. So give me a second. So if I'm not mistaken, there was a side quest available here in Bright Market and appears as though I am correct. So, uh, hello, good sir, Fernand. Ah, machine riding Nora with a special spear. How lucky to come across you. I have a proposal. Come closer. Call me Fernand. That sounds really rapey. Um, and he kind of looks like the guy we just... Well, the guy that just blew himself up. Okay, Fernand. What's your proposal? During the reign of that idiot Kaiju King, outlanders often hid items of value from raiders. Well, I found one. What is it? A relic from the old ones. You probably would understand it better than I do. Unfortunately, it's too high for me to reach. Uh-huh, and you want me to get it for you? What a brilliant plan! You're a much better climber than I am, to be sure. Yeah, I think we are. Get it? Bring it back, and we'll split the proceeds. How about I see what it is first? That works, too. Okay, and what are you looking hey, at? Fernand, my eyes are up here. I'm looking at your spear. It's magnificent, but how does it work? You stick the pointy end into the machine. <laughs> yes, but how does it turn foe into friend? It's simple, really. Yes? You wouldn't understand. <laughs> yeah, of course we wouldn't tell you that. And what do you do exactly? What do you do exactly? Wow, that, I I'm didn't know that of fine tinkering. what she was going to say. But. I buy low, sell high. But in this case, you wouldn't be buying. Sometimes I find tinkerings as well. He's a creepy son of a bitch. So, uh, what do you need? Let's say I'm interested. What do I need to do? The relic rests on the rise of Dusk Mesa. Bring it to me at the Meridian Docks, and we will both profit. We'll see about that. Yeah, a curious proposal. Let's put that as our active quest. It is an errand, so it shouldn't take too long. So go to the Dusk Mesa. So see you guys over there in a second, because I'm really curious what that item is going to be. So the Dusk Mesa, we're pretty close, we're at the closest campfire you can find. I haven't discovered this one yet. So uh, let's cross the water and it should be on the other side here. I think there's something really angry at me. A relic from the old ones. Now I'm really, really curious what that is going to be. I need to climb up somewhere. Is it that thing over there? There's definitely something up there. Dust also ram chest. Now I need to find some place too high to reach, if I'm to believe anything for none said. So I think this way is probably the easiest way to get up there. So let's try that out. Those glint hawks were a real bitch. So there we go, chest. And it's empty. An empty chest. Spear girl! Ah, he wants our spear. You found it. The perfect location for an ambush. <laughs> now throw down that magnificent spear and we'll let you live. Um, fuck you. You've obviously heard of me. You know what I'm capable of. Why do you think this will turn out well for you? I like the odds. Get her. Why do I bother? I'm at a really difficult spot at the moment. Oh shit, I'm almost almost dropping off as well. Wait, you already lost me? Well, that is unfortunate for you guys. There, she's gotten above us. Yeah, of course I'm above you, you fucking idiots. 
I started out above you. Yeah. Where's Fernand? I'm on target. What are they waiting for? Almost got it. I don't think you do actually, but escape the outlanders or kill the outlanders. That's the last of them. Why would I want to escape them? Right to the Meridian Docks, I'll bet. Would he be at the place that he told us to meet him? Because that would be really, really dumb. Of him, not of us. That was might have been a, a good assumption, but yeah, that would have been really dumb of him to go over there. So see you guys over there in a second. So let me check this out. Fernand! I want to have a little chat with you and preferably stick that spear you wanted all along into your gut. That's him. Oh no. But he got the prince out with help from the spies. Dr. Fernand. Where the hell? Did he just go Let up? Let me in! Like fire and spit! Let me in! Um. No. Oh, Fernand. Our deal is off. Oh, it's you. How about a new deal? You could just cut off my finger, or my hand, or my left arm, but that's my final offer. Um, that won't be enough. Oh, it won't be enough. It wouldn't. Not here, not in front of everyone. No one's gonna lift a finger to stop me. You just led a group of men to their deaths, remember? They were bad men. I did a service, really. You did. You did the service. I'll make sure it never happens again. I am to so gonna Understood. murder you. You won't hear from any of us ever again. I'd better not. Can't I just kill him? Like this? No? Can't do that? No? No, apparently not. God damn it, that's sad. I wanted to murder the man. But hey, let's, uh, yeah, with that build, I'm gonna take a little break. So thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And I'll hope to see you in the next episode where we'll probably try another batch of side quests. So see you guys next time. Goodbye.